hi guys welcome back to my channel hope you guys are doing great and you all are good out there well today's video is about how to cover the under eye dark circles and this was requested by one of my friend so I'm very excited about this video in today's video I'll be showing you tricks and tips to cover the under eye dark circles many of us have dark circles some can cover it with just using a single concealer but while some need few more steps to cover it completely so here I am to show you some um, easy ways to cover the under eye dark circles and hope this video helps. So before starting the video, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon just to get notified every time I post new videos. So without any more further talking, let's get into the video. Well guys, as you can see, I too have dark circles, fine lines and yes, puffy eyes sometimes but uh, the things that is necessary to take care before color correcting is to hydrate your under eye area just to avoid any kind of dryness and to avoid dryness it is necessary to use an under eye cream so that it smooths out the area and yes hydrates it as well well these small steps are going to make a lot of difference so yes don't skip the steps instead follow the steps every time you color correct the eye area here i'm using an under eye cream from plum okay so it is an under eye recovery gel i'm just taking a pump on my finger massaging for 15 seconds by tapping under the eyes helps to increase the blood circulation and release tension once you massage it well next i'm going to use a pore filling primer and here i'm using a primer from inside cosmetics all over my face including the under eye area just to fill in the fine lines it works the best if you use a silicone based primer I'm going to use a color corrector which is the most awaited part and here I'm using a color corrector from Inside Cosmetics. Well this is a concealer palette from Inside Cosmetics and it has quite good shades for Indian skin tone. Well it is affordable and beginner friendly as well. Here I'm going to use a peach color corrector. So let me tell you if you are from light to medium uh, skin tone like from light to wheatish skin tone you can use a peach color corrector but if you have a dark skin tone it is better to use an orange color corrector okay and as you can see the shadows are mostly casted in the inner and the outer corners so I'm going to take a peach corrector and I'm going to apply it in the inner and the outer corner and I'm going to blend it in such a way bringing it towards the center Peach corrector neutralizes the skin tone by cancelling the blue undertones. So now you can see my skin tone looks little even all around the face. Can you see the difference? Well now we are going to apply foundation all over our face except the under eye because we are going to conceal it again with a concealer and we don't want unnecessary layering of the products under the eyes as it settles in the fine lines and starts creasing. Also one more thing should be taken care of is using a beauty blender instead of a makeup brush because beauty blender pushes the foundation into the skin without disturbing the color corrector while the bristles of the makeup brush might pull the color corrector from its place and get mixed with the foundation. Now I'm taking a concealer that is exactly of my shade and here I'm using a concealer from L'Oreal and I'm going to apply it again in the inner and the outer corner of my eyes because maximum darkness is towards the corners okay and I'm going to blend it with my finger again or else you can use a sponge for me fingers work the best the warmth of the fingers just melt the product so beautifully that it looks well blended and seamless can you see the difference
and when you are blending the concealer just make sure you look up because that way the creases are not formed and the blending is done properly and yes obviously when you are using a cream product it is very necessary to use a powder on top of it to set it properly so here i'm using a powder from miss claire with the help of a brush tap of the excess i'm going to apply it under my eyes and make sure when you are applying look up now can you see the finishing looks so smooth using a lighter shade concealer directly on top of dark circles let me tell you what it does is it makes it look ashy okay we don't want to look ashy right this is what the difference it makes i'm going to come back quickly with my finished look as you can see the under eye dark circles have totally uh, vanished just by adding few extra steps and i hope the video has helped you and i hope you are going to follow the steps and let me know if you try it out and uh, also if you know any extra steps um, please do let me know in the comment section this is not going to make your eyes look cakey i swear just follow these steps i hope the video was helpful don't forget to like the video and yes please do subscribe to my channel i'm going to link my instagram handle in the comment section i'm going to see you guys in my next video till then you guys take good care of yourself bye